Ugh, factory resets. I know it can be a gigantic pain in the neck to do a factory reset of your router, especially if you have a lot of devices set up just the way you like them. However, after a firmware update, it is always recommended to do a factory reset. So we're gonna go through that process with Duma OS. First thing you're gonna do is use your browser that you use. I use Chrome. Then you're gonna log into Duma OS. Once you've done that, you'll go to settings, administration, backup settings. Now, the first thing you'll notice is the backup here. If you're just wanting to reset the router and things are kind of going weird and you're not doing a firmware update, you can back your stuff up and restore it. But if you're doing a firmware update, this is not recommended at all. Always just use the erase. Do not back it up and restore because there may be stuff that was messed up from a, the previous firmware that if you back up may get stored and then you're bringing it into the fixed firmware by restoring those old settings. So that's just a, just a heads up for everybody. I've seen people do that a couple times and go, ooh, stuff's not working right. This should be working right. Yeah, you might have accidentally thought that that would be an okay thing to do, and it's kind of not. So what we're going to do is uh, we've just installed firmware recently. I'm going to click the erase button. <laughs> Say, are you sure you want to lose all your settings, buddy? And yeah, we're sure. And you're just going to let it go through the process. And you're going to set everything back up. If this video was helpful, please take the time to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and as always, take her easy.